greetings programs got an unboxing for you today before i continue i'd like to say that i've done this unboxing before it's not loading up to youtube so i'll try this again it's for star trek into darkness the limited villain edition um blu-ray so here's the front spine back and it comes with a statue from hot wheels um so okay here are the extras by the way they include um uh, creating the red planet attack on south fleet excuse me never try and frame this um the klingon home world the enemy of my enemy ship to ship and brawl by the bay so there you have it here's the blu-ray itself um love it um uh, you can see star trek into the darkness is framed and you can see the the embossing on the edges excuse me star trek into darkness is embossed and you can see the frame on the edges excuse me so anyway, uh, here's it all opened up uh so 2d blu-ray as you can see it's paramount so they don't do too much with their blu-rays uh, so here's the inside artwork that's is 3d blu-ray by the way so put this back 3d blu-ray 2d blu-ray i'll stress that the extras are ridiculous they're about 40 minutes long i was hoping for something a bit more and the director's commentary has been moved to the, the digital copy which is stupid but i will not rant too much about it because dino last has done that already so check out his video uh check out his page in fact dino last really cool unboxing yeah so check it out his that his steel book is much more different from mine his is the enterprise crashing into earth or something like that so yeah it's ridiculous the extras are i saw this at the london imax the 3d is phenomenal and yeah i would highly recommend that even if you're blind by it you won't be disappointed and there's the statue of the uss vengeance incredibly small not too much detail into it and it does not check out my other statues or my other sculptures that i got the battle rank from batman arkham asylum the outer year statue from assassin's creed 2 and sam fisher from splinter cell conviction all of them are much bigger than this pile of crap um not what i expected i actually expected something a little bit bigger but i did not get it which is unfortunate i kind of feel like it was a waste of money i love the steel book but i feel maybe i should have got the version dino last got but yeah there you have it so yes it fits it fits nicely with my version of the original star trek blu-ray steelbook yeah so uh, like i said great film highly recommend it i know some people did not like it um but i don't know why they not like it i really enjoyed it i'm not i guess i'm not as much a trekker as most fans are but yeah i really thoroughly enjoyed this movie and would highly recommend it to anybody to watch and also by the way on wednesday i'm going to be watching riddick at the london imax so i look forward to checking that out when i get a chance but yeah that's my unboxing my mild rant my um my mild review as well oh yeah so i checked out the extras they were good but not enough not what i expected i really hoped that i really hoped the director's commentary would have been in there anyway thanks you thanks for watching stay tuned to my next video tron lives oh and don't forget to check out dino last video as well or check out his page altogether. all right thank you very much tron lives